Ooh. Hello, darkness, my old friend. You know what? Let's let God decide what they call me. And I'm gonna click now. Oh, I didn't pick my own nickname. Okay then. You you can call me the Legend 47. You know, if you click on this video, didn't read the title. It's the four times weakness only Pokemon challenge. So I start off this big boy Scyther, and oh my god, look how big he is. But anyway, yeah. The going through the list, by the way, a lot of the Pokemon are flying types. Yeah, get ready for that. Anyway, let's start this adventure. Bugs Z. Even cooler than Bugsy. Huh. I see why you don't get Scyther at this low of a level. What a weird moveset. Alright, Shauna. We'll fight. And that was easy. Bye bye, Froki. Mom, what's a map? Is that some weird type of GPS you old people use? What is Scyther's level of moveset? Oh my god. Vacuum Wake, attack, and now pursuit. This is a weird moveset, Scyther. Aren't you a bug flying type? Alright, to the fight by all. Now, bugs, listen to me. Focus your energy. Good job, Bugsy. Now, quick attack. Quick attack again. And it doesn't kill. Great, she's gonna heal. But better on Source Kit than Vivian. So we get a Vivian, it's out. And time to quick attack it. And it impositions me. And I'm in red health. And it's dead. Thank god I have quick attack. So, Scyther, how's it feel? Your first victory. I know, it would have been easy to have wing attack, but you don't get it to level 21 for some reason. You know, might get any call from Bugsy, since this kind of looks like a ladybug. That's kind of what his badge was. So, yeah. Might be a continental sewing thing going on. Ooh, hovering Pokeballs. You know, it's kind of fun to really think about. It's a new generation, but then Sycamore here as a Gen 1 or has all three Candle Stars and you choose them after the fight. It's like, seriously, Candle Stars, you can really ditch it for the Candle Star. I guarantee you, some people did it. Like, you know what? Screw you, Fennekin. I'm gonna get a Charmander or something like that. I say Fennekin, let's be real. Who actually likes Fennekin? I like Fennekin. You know, times you have four times weaknesses. And none of them do. You know, I never got this. I know I'm like a prodigy for your eyes, whatever. Like, we just met. My only credibility is my mom's a famous Rhyhorn racer, and you give me this rare stone. I think last turn just low key and see a way that Diane's gonna become ugly when she's old. You're a rude man, Lysander. Sorry, Lucario. I can't drive. Hmm, I wanna become more gangster. What's more gangster than wasting honey? This is not what I wanted. Like I said, what's more gangster than wasting honey? God damn it. I wanna track the hood. Throw some honey around. Hey, the hoodlums are here. I'm a cool guy because I'm now a gangster. I mean, hey, don't look at me. This thing becomes a hoodlum Pokemon. I'm more gangster than Fuewe. Man, I was kind of hoping I got the one with Intimidate. Oh, well. Huh, but my Pokemon are brave. I wonder how that happened. And now for a training montage, you get Fuewe up to level 16 with, like, Scyther. One training montage later. Well, Fuewe proved he used. attack. Fan attack again. It two shot. To be fair, I'm like, five levels over level. Well, I guess we're having lobster tonight, folks. This is the most intense staring contest I've ever been in. It's like a mountain, except the black belt's taller than it, and we're all actually taller than it. I mean, I know it's for the 3DS, but come on, they could at least said, It's so fat, we can't get around it, you know? <laughs> Better get my wrists ready, Scyther. Hey, Shauna. You should jump. Oh, she actually did it. You know, I like Duckle, but why the fuck is it 10% encounter rate? So yeah, it's my water flying type. Oh, water bird Pokemon. They really didn't know what to name this one, huh? Bye. Don't ask why. I don't know either. Folks, what you put the witness is a violent battle between the Blood Gang and the Crypt Gang. Viewer discretion is advised. Are right, you were warned. Watch this deadly gameplay. A Pikachu, shit! Scrap you! Get out of here, check that click, and break the core fish away. And... Wow, Fletching's dead, we lost of blood. Okay, keep going. Well, baby. Gangster gotta get out of there, Flurry. Alright, Ducklet, Water Pulse. Why are you not a Grass-type? I don't know, I might have used it if you were a Grass-type. That's behind that. If you avert your eyes from that Valley Gang Warfare, you can now turn back to the screen. It is over. You'll never see them again. Maybe. Okay, I promise. This is my last Pokemon for a while. We caught Inke. I hereby dub the Colt. I won't be 100% honest. The team player theme is not good. It does not match how snazzy they are. Yeah, and if you're wondering, I'm not going to be using Amora. Mostly because I love Auroras. I but I've used it too much. Also, the fact that fighting and steel for touch weaknesses is kind of shit, even for this team standards. But I do love Auroras. I'm going to face the Rock Boy. He immediately paralyzes me with Amora, then Amora dies to Brick Break. Next up is Tyron. It's just paraflinching me for a bit, but Static goes away. It with one Brick Break, but then Scraggy falls. The gangster's fallen. This is not the paradise we dreamed of. And then Inky comes out to get out with Foul Play after very surviving. Wow, Tyron. You really have a strong jaw, don't you? You tell me to never give up, but giving up's kind of fun. Ooh, Rock Climbing Badge. I worked so hard for it. Is it just me or do Team Flare going so like they say this is real hip hop and it's start of a shitty rap song? Fighting Karina prematurely, just like how I am. Don't worry about that. Scraggy, brick break, and Scraggy's dead. Damn it. The gangster got took out by Lucario of all people. We can attack Scyther. Okay, we can attack again. Really? That's a little faint to be after a sword stance? Wow, faint's pathetically weak. Or is it Lucario? 
Lucario overrated confirmed. Oh my god, Squid King's evolving. And look at it. He's beautiful. You know, I can't remember. How do we discover the Trinity DS upside down? I guarantee you someone just hang out their bed upside down and it happened to them. That's probably how it happened. You know, it's been about a day since I last played this. I forgot that was my name, The Legend 47. <laughs> uh, what is wrong with me? How many times do I have to tell you, old man? It was me who found the stone. God damn it, Tierno. This is sort of way to get rich and you ruined it by finding an ordinary rock. Hey, Serena, before we say it's better, try one question for you. Can you do this? I know, impressive. I call it the panty dropper move. I need help. Okay, time to throw down. Alright, Serena, let's fight. You have a meow stick, fake out, you're a bitch. And then disarm your voice. You'd be light to the rescue though, fan attack, scraggy. Hold and lift. Who's next? Absol, Scythe their fury cut. Critical hit and one shot. That is overkill, but we take it. Who's last? Oh no, breaks it. Ducklet, do it. And you're confused, and you hit yourself. And you hit yourself again. Wow, really going to that stupid duckling vibe, huh? Alright, Malamar, swagger. Now, use... What's it called? Foul play, and it's dead. Good job, Calamari. But Ducklet, I expect better, you stupid little duckling. Look how dead this game is. I forgot this game, they don't bob and weave around if you just... Don't press the A button, so look how still everyone is with the music. Like, oh my god, look at the guru. Why are you looking at me like that? Oh no, he's about to R. Kelly me. Alright, Karina, let's fight. Air Slash. You didn't go for a figure, that's surprising. Power up punch, why'd you go fight my flying type? You're gonna heal and Air Slash kills. No, nice job. Macho, go, Colt. Side Beam, Rock Tomb, you fool, I have contrary, this pees me up. Now die, Macho, who's last, Halucha? Okay, Side Beam. Okay, save him again. You're dead. So, Karina, how's it feel like? Getting your ass. He's calling himself Lady Karina, for what I can tell, an unironic way. If I ever start unironically for myself as Lord Mudkip or whatever, please, for the love of God, tell me I'm shit and shoot me. Or punch me in the face like the badge is entailed. Because I, got, I gotta tell you people, again, punching the face is a good way to make sure you're still in line. If Sicario wanted to join my team, but it has no four times weaknesses, I know the solution. There we go, problem solved. Oh my god, my little stupid duck's evolving. Look at that, it's become a beauta- A fi- A swan. It became a swan. You're not gonna let me say no, are you, Serena? This is battle rape. I think. I don't know. I don't consent to this. But she doesn't take my answer. Just like real life. You know Diantha for the champion? You really are nowhere. Like, we only see you in the coffee shop and in here, till the championship. You don't even try to stop Lysander. You know what? I'll, I can at least give Cynthia and Lance this. They were there for some of the parts of their bad guys teams. Wait, you can go to Route 13 before the 5th gym badge? I had no idea, honestly. I always thought it was blocked off. Cool. I'm saying this because, well, there's a certain teammate here that I'm gonna get. And it's not who you think it is. I redact my last statement because I can't get it till after I beat the 4th gym. That's embarrassing. And also stupid. But we'll get into that later. I gotta keep y'all guessing who it is, even though that kinda spoils it in a way. You know, this has me thinking. In my Pokemon Ultra Sun's only Steel Types team, I lost to Hop a few amount of times because Steel Types are really slow levelers and shit. And also, they can take one level up. So I wonder, you can you lose to Serena, and will the story still progress? I know you can lose to Hop, not Hop, but how and still progress. Sorry. And I'm saying this because, well, this fight was so uneventful and boring. I just gotta bring up a point. I forgot how bad the level balancing in this game was with the EXP share being on, because I am over leveled. Whatever, Swana, Air Slash, good job. This first time we've seen Swana sweep in a while. Good thing I turned it off, and I still can't get my next team member because it's locked behind Team Flare. Fuck my life. You know, Ramos, I don't know what's weirder. You having big scissors or your weird ass page that you only sound like a Weird Al album. Except the difference is Weird Al has a charisma and music talent. You just have a giant pair of scissors. You know, they're gonna talk this really to me and yet be more useless than a Geodude. Like, seriously. Oh, just kidding. You have a fine way of jokes. I almost had Scyther cut you to bits. I might still do it. I might leave you some pain because I just hate you two so much. Hey, you two look like you watched Bill and I growing up. How about you jump to that electricity and see what happens? It'll be our own little science experiment. Please? God damn it, didn't work, guys. Now I can get my next team member. First try, come on. Damn it. And I caught a Slugma. I honestly didn't know Slugma was in this game. And I didn't ever know you can get it in this game here. So yeah, if y'all know that, comment below and tell me I'm a fucking idiot. Just do that anyway, I find it funny. What can I say, folks? I'm a natural comedian. And that's a horrible nature. I'm re-rolling. Well, this took a few tries, but I got it. Now for the grinding montage. By that I mean beat all the gym leaders trainers and run around the grass for probably three hours so you can be competently leveled. The rest of my team. One training montage later. Before you say someone doesn't have any portals to this, it's about to. I have two actually. And finally, the name pun is at its fullest. Welcome to the team, my cargo. And now introducing the kid to run the X and Y anime for me. Bonnie, people! Yep, 
She ruined the whole anime for me. It's like how Max Cam ruins the Gen 3 anime for me. I hate both of them. What can I say? I hate little annoying kid characters. Even though I probably was a little annoying kid growing up. But we don't talk about that. So, Clement, I heard you want to be like a Lisa a lot. You're copying your strategy of Molga Voltswitch. Whatever. Foul play. At the swagger. Wow, I just did a lot. I forgot. Steel doesn't resist dark anymore. Bye bye, Magneton. Who's next? Heal you up. Heal you list? Swagger. And is it himself. That hurts a lot. And he's down. Scraggy, go. High jump kick. And a one shot. Good job. Evil 8 OP. Who's last? Oh, Mogo again. I forgot. All right. Use ancient power, my cargo. Well, you got the boost. He's going to heal and he's dead. Wow, that was really easy, honestly. Thank God I got the badge. Now, I never have to see that annoying little girl ever again. You know, there's more things to life than Mega Evolution, Professor Sycamore. Just saying. Don't you have a wife? No, that's Kakui. Never mind, you fucking loser. Hello, forgettable friend number four. How are you feeling? All right, time to fight Serena. And I just thought of a horror damage with this fight. Malamar, who's like the squid monster from yesterday, supposed to be based off like an elegant cat. And it's like an elegant rich woman's cat being strangled to death by a squid. Yeah, maybe not imagine it. All right, Scraggy, clean up the rest. High jump kick? Yeah, absolutely. Like Crunch the Del Fox. And wow, that one shot. Speaking of which, something's about to happen. My Scratch is probably going to become Hoodlum. Uh, if DMX was still around, the spring of tear was I, a Hoodlum Pokemon. Time to fight the fairy type generally. Still live with Mawile. I live with Mike Cargo. Level 2 one shot. Thanks, that's Mr. Mime. I stay in go for a while, so much damage it does. Sits up Blaster, so does nothing. Send out Scyther, then I take it out for one X scissor. Good job, with a crit, but it's set up Reflect. Next up, Sylveon. I send out V, bye, it has a key star. Start going for air, so she gets some flinches. I get one, so it'll stall long enough for her to heal, but also for, for her to screen fall, which is good, but then I get taken out. I send out my cargo, it gets burned, and then it's just a stall fest. So it eventually dies from lava plumes and burns, and my cargo barely survives. That was... A fight. I did not expect it to go that way. Huh. I now have the insult to homosexuals badge. Please no one take that seriously. It's the fairy badge. What a very creative name. Yes, I got it. Finally. Scyther so was the perfect starter. Four times a week to rock. It's going to be four times a week to fire when it evolves. Perfect. And the best part, Scyther was only eight experience away from evolving. I'm serious. <laughs> uh, he looks like he wants to evade Russia in the winter now. Come on, final team member. Ponyard. Yay. Four times a week to fighting. That's going to be fun. What can I say? I'm creative as always. Uh, finally someone recognizes my power. Thank you. Mabel, is that your name? You know, I know I made a joke earlier about Serena battling me without my consent, but also telling me we're gonna battle. I prefer she just jump me. That'd be a lot funnier. Like, era blue or silver, they just appear and like, Bitch, we're fighting whether you like it or not. You know, not like, hey, I challenge you in front of the gym. Let's see. Huh, Swana can't learn Blizzard. One of the few other types I can't do it. I'm glad I wasted all my money on the Blizzard TM. Really should look that up. Comment down below, I'm an idiot for buying Blizzard. Thank you very much. Alright, let's get this gang warfare started. A cat? Alright, Bishop, use assurance. Good job, you killed it. That's a Delphox. Fox. Alright. Let's go, my cargo. Ancient power. Ancient power again. One of my ancient powers APP. I found a lot of PP maxes while trying to find this guy. It was annoying. Anyway, who's who's next? Jolteon? I guess high jump kick. Absol? Okay, high jump kick. You know, this is pathetic. I'm happy these Pokemon never use. Like, also, I just realized half my team was dark type. I don't know if I mentioned that yet. But yeah, hopefully that won't come bite me in the ass, because, well, you know, Diantha has a Mega Gardevoir. That's going to be fun to deal with. Whatever your name is, because you're so forgettable, I announce you a weirdest hairdo. Seriously, what the fuck is that? I can put my head through your hair. What do you even touch me? That being said, I have a big head, so maybe not. Nice earrings, though. Okay, she leads off a Sigilith. Huh, stupid Pokemon banner, stupid hairstyle. Even though I like Sigilith. That's a different story. Air Slash. Not Air Slash, Night Slash. What am I thinking? These Air Slash on me. It's dead. Cool. Slow King. Boy, are we crunch it? Oh, you lower dispense. The flex worthless. Who's last? A kitty? I have plenty of space killing kitties. Okay, Colt. Night slash. And she's gonna heal stall. She's gonna spray that pussy. My god, that pussy is so soaked. And yes, people, this is the highbrow comedy you should expect from me. And it's dead. Good job, Olympia. Did you just give me one of your earrings of the gym badge? Okay, then. Now for the plot to kick in. Time to go fight Lysander. You know, Lysander, how egotistical are you in the labs after yourself? Like, you're talking about how, like, humans need to be more perfect and restart, but then you're just a big egotist, which is really basically number one of human flaws. Just saying. Egotist, I meant narcissist. What if I like Sander? He has a mean food to start. You know, mean food's not like my pawn here. It's weak, low stats, but evolves really late because they're overpowered. But, the up's better. Gyarados, air slash, you flinch. Nice, air slash, outrage, and buys down. Okay. Malamark, finish it, and it's self confusion. Nice. Pyro, superpower. Who's last? Murkrow, superpower. Yep, superpower from the superhero. Wit saves the day. Alright, Lysander, I'll see you in the next place to fight. Oh my god, Bishop's evolving. It's gonna be complete. Perfect. He is now ready to touch miners. Too soon? Probably not. Alright, Lysander, let's fight again. Me and Chad, bye bye. Who's next? Gyarados? Swana? Air Slash. Oh god, Air Slash. Oh, you flinched it. Nice. So it's gonna die. Your outrage is mean nothing. Who's next? Power? Alright, my cargo. Ancient power. Ancient power again. Kill it. Who's that? Honchcrow? Ancient power. Ancient power again. Why don't you learn power, Jim? You really need it. 
Okay, Lysander, let's cut the shit. Let's get, get your Mega Ring. Let's fight right here and right now. All right, Lysander, you got your ring. Let's fight. They're not even higher level. See, I told you. I just let him get his ring. We're fighting again. Mian Chao's gone. Pyroar, my cargo go. I'm saving Swana for later. Ancient Power. Keep Ancient Power in. Good. Who's next? Honchkrow? Ancient Power. Oh my god, he got burned. Recovery. Yes, here. you healthy. Who's last? Scared us? He's gonna Mega Evolve? Oh yeah, watch this. My master plan. Feather Dance. Yes, Swana. Keep Feather Dancing. Shake that little swan ass for him. That's right. Gyarados loves swan ass, I guess. And, yep, he's attacks lowered. Caesar finished off with Exeter. Nope. And Rocky Helmet killed it. How fitting. How fitting that Lysander's last Pokemon killed itself, considering what's about to happen. <laughs> Alright, y'all, I got a game theory of my own. You know how people theorize that the, uh, what's it called? The Strike and City Gym Leaders are the Shadow Tracks. They don't help the end of the game. My theory is, Sigmore was in the in this all along. Like, he knew what Lysander was doing. That's why he kept saying he was a great man. And then, when it all fell through, because we know we we're going to stop him, he stayed behind, and he came to this town to clear his name and say, Oh, I had no idea he was this evil. Because think about it, that beam could advance evolution if it hit the Pokemon the right way, and he loves advancing evolution. Mega Evolution is his kink. So that's just a theory. My theory. Yeah, if I was on Event that's why I'm talking about this. I don't want to cross this bridge. Oh well. Identify Sean Silver, Dale Caddy, and Flame Body activates immediately. Why can't I activate for the more important fights? Lava Plume. Alright, I'm just gonna recover to be at full health when it dies. Who's next? Alright, Gudra? Okay, Scrappy, high jump kick. Good job, and now everyone's level 59. Nice. Your bulky Gudra couldn't just say anything. Who's last? Your Ninja Frog? Water Shuriken, of course, hit five times. High jump kick. Kick to the throat, you're dead. Maybe that joke about Tiana being gangster is true, because he just jumped me after the fights he thinks Sean weaken me up. Okay, Ancient Power. Got the boost. Really wish I got the boost in more important fights. Whatever. Crawdon? I guess I'll just ancient power it. Keep the boost. Oh, and he's swords dancing. He's an idiot. Who's that? Roserade, Pell Dance, whatever. Flamethrower, and you're dead, Tierno. I guess the Crips really did lose today. You know, I just thought about something. You know how I said earlier Sycamore was working with the Flystanics who know to be found? Where the hell were Tierno and Trevor? I, well, Trevor probably went along because he's a simp for the professor, we're being honest. Tierno, I bet Sycamore promised him to put a uh, dance at the strip club. You know, Tierno loves his dances. Can we talk about how Ash lost the two most pathetic gym leaders in this region in the anime? By Ola? And Wolfric. I can understand Grant with his powerful tower fuse of him, but seriously, those two? It was a super powerful sweep. Even Cryo don't try to confuse me, but I didn't hit myself at all. It was all a sweep. Luckily, I didn't hit myself three times in a row like I did in my last attempt that y'all didn't see, but you don't need to know about that. You know, Wolfric, you know what saves you from being the worst gym leader in this region? The fact that you give away Ice Beam, the best TM move in the game, in my opinion. So, you're cool. That's where I got a swan. I can't learn it like I can't learn Blizzard. Thank God he can learn Ice Beam. You know, I really need to get a life, because I know what each and all these trainers have as Pokemon. Yeah, that's kind of sad, honestly. Alright, Serena, this is your last stand. Alright, Swords Dance, Bishop, and your Dizzy Elf is nothing. Night Slash is dead. Delphox? Okay, Bishop, you got this. And it's right at 3 health. Good job. You don't have my to be that. Alright. Colt, you use Superpower. Keep going. Superpower. Good job. Plus 2. Now, Altaria, Psycho Cut. That doesn't kill. But you live with Dazzling Gleam. Nice. Psycho Cut. Who's last? Absol. Alright. High jump kick, Fwewey. <laughs> like, I only call Fwewey by his nickname. Uh, and Serena's dead. It was a sweep. Well, not really a sweep, it's just that I counter all of her Pokemon. I should have fight Dragon Mommy Drazen. Don't want to save her for last, but I had a good strategy against her. Psycho Cut, her whatever the fuck the Poison Dragon is called. Then Ice Beam one shots her Altaria, Noiburn. The Dragon tanks the Ice Beam. Now, of all the Pokemon, I'm surprised Dragon took tanked one. But only one, because he died the next turn. Okay, you're always a pleasure to battle. I should have fight Wickstrom. He leads off with. Clef key. I went for a taunt. I took out one flamethrower. Next is Pro Pass. I send out Fwewey. Hit it with a high jump kick. Sturdy survives. Speaking of Flash Cannon. So I crunch it to break it. Sturdy at three heals. And high jump kick takes it out. Next up is Aegislash. After getting off a double King Shield. A King Shield twice in a row for some reason. Got them both. Lucky bastard. Take it out with a flamethrower. So take her sword. Last up Caesar. Survive at eight health from Iron Head. Take it out with one flamethrower. Look, Wickstrom. I know the pain of a Caesar having four times weak to fire. It happened to me once. Then to fight whatever her name is. Excellent team player member. So he's off at Pyro. He's off at my cargo. I H power it. H power again. It dies. I'm at half health because of Hyper Voice. Torkoal gets one shot by Surf. Next up's Town Flame. Send Torkoal back out. Eat the Braver. One shot it with Angel Power. Big, anyone surprised? Last up's Chandelure. I send out Fuer. We hit it with a crunch. It's going to be which is totally useless, by the way, to me. But it leaves out one HP. He heals. Take down one head smash. And there you go. I defeated you like how I defeated Team Flare. How's it feel? The bolt looks like he just came out of his edgy phase. Anyway, let's fight. Colitzer. Air Slash. Air Slash but it doesn't kill it. Oh, great. So we're going to be still a heal stall. Well, at least my flinching with the King's Rock is great. And Colitzer's dead. Who's next? Oh, Barboach. High Jump Kick. Fuery. Who's next? Starmie. Night Slash. Who's last? Gyarados. Oh, Defiant fucks over your Intimidate. Night Slash. Dragon Ants. Uh oh. Earthquake. There goes Bit Sharp. All right, Swana. <laughs> Air Slash. Wait, he misses Ice Fang. He misses Ice Fang again. Air Slash. 
Okay, I don't think I'll ever get that lucky again. Still, your name's stupid and your art sucks, and battling will never be an art. And to put a champ who doesn't leave a room, apparently. She's off with Halucha. I lead off with Swana. Here's the swords. I take out Air Slash. Next up is Aurora. I send out Colt to hit Chica with a superpower. Next up's Tyrantra. I hit it with superpower. She goes for a heal stock. I really don't kill it. I bet you take it out. Next up's Gudra. Same thing as before. I bet you take it out with Psycho Cut and superpower. So she heals up. I bet you take it out with Psycho Cut since so she's done heal stalling. And then Gorgas was done a one. Psycho Cut. Last up's Gardevoir. I send out Caesar. She mega evolves. Thunderbolts. I Iron Head. One shot her. And that was that. Ah, uh, Diantha, what a weak champion. You know, I don't know how this is scientifically possible, but let's not question it. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this challenge. I decided to bring back an old bear in mind, the 4 times weakness only challenge. And the funny thing is, I tried so hard not to have most of my team be flying types that I had half my team be dark types. That was a complete fluke, honestly. Well, I hope you all enjoy. Subscribe for more. All that other bullshit. Comment to see the future. Share it if you found it interesting, and uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Peace, bitches.